Hi, Chef EJ here. Thank you for visiting our website. Welcome to my kitchen. Today we're going to take a moment and show you a fabulous new product. These are all handmade, hand-painted ceramic graters, and each one of these are actually very unique. Again, done by hand, these little edges on here, the rough part, it's actually etched with a fork, so there are no two that are identical. Each one's an original piece of artwork and very functional. Use it for mincing garlic, grating ginger. You could use it on simple things like cheese or zesting, lemons, oranges, or any citrus fruit, right down to the hardest of spices. But real quick, I'm going to show you on garlic. Show you the quick and easy way to peel it. These are nothing new. You can buy them in most of your gourmet or restaurant stores for about 8 to $9. We actually give them away with our graters, and I'll give you more details in just a moment. Just put it inside, roll it, and uh, it perfectly peels it. And here's the good part. It leaves the garlic clove whole. Now, you don't want to smash these down. You want that garlic clove to be whole, because when you rub it over the surface of the grater, you see the way it perfectly minces it? Unlike a garlic press, you don't get the chunks that take longer to cook, or basically longer to digest. That's why you end up tasting garlic the next day. Mince it fine like this, you avoid that. And here's where the fun begins. Leave the garlic in the dish, pour some olive oil, maybe a little vinegar in there as well, a good quality balsamic vinegar. You have a dipping tray and pass it around the table. Absolutely delicious. We're going to give you some more fantastic ideas. Now, if you want to add this garlic directly to recipes, now most people lick it out of the dish. I recommend using the little brush. They normally charge $5 for these when you order them online. Uh, we're going to include it in our special today. Simply turn the garlic into a ball. It just rolls out into your recipes. Now look at how perfect this comes out. There's no way you're going to do that with a knife or a press. That's going to cook evenly, blend evenly, taste better. Real quick on the ginger. See, ginger is tough. It has little fibers. You chop it with a knife or even use a microplane, you still end up getting those bitter little fibers. If you use a grater, you're going to notice the good stuff stays in the dish. The bitter fibers, the tough part of the ginger that you don't want, that's left behind. That's going to be about three times sweeter and stronger than chopped ginger. Add this directly into salad dressings, into marinades. And the reason it's going to pack such a punch, watch this, that's where all the flavor is. It's locked in the juice. And that's the part you normally use, miss, I should say, when you use a microplane or even chop it with a knife. And here's a delicious recipe. Two ingredients. It doesn't get any easier than this. Take the garlic, mix it with the ginger. Now this turns into a paste, and you could coat vegetables with this. Use it in stir fry. You slap that on a pork chop, put that on your barbecue, you think you died and went to heaven. It's absolutely delicious. And here's the fun part. We pass the whole thing around the table. Block of Parmesan, everybody grates cheese for themselves. This is very handy right around the holidays. Have a house full of freeloader, I mean uh, family, you make them do the work themselves. It's fresher, tastes better, and uh, really does a wonderful job on that as well. Now if you have cheese that's a little softer, a little moister, chill it. Same thing with chocolate. In fact, chocolate, you'll love it on for desserts. This is my kid's favorite. If you do any baking, you'll love this for chocolate over desserts. You can even do hard stuff like coconut as well. Really comes out delicious. And then when it comes to spices, I've showed you on many things, soft, different textures. But what about the really hard stuff? Cinnamon, nutmeg. If you buy it whole like this and grate it fresh, it's about three times stronger than the stuff that you buy in the jars. You never know how old that stuff is. If you could only smell this right now, the aromas are outrageous. Anyways, the dishes, dishwasher safe. Cleanup is very easy or just rinse it under tap water. And uh, again, we thank you for visiting our kitchen. Uh, browse around our website. Pick out the colors you want. We're going to give you all the accessories free today. And uh, we hope you tell all your friends and neighbors where you got it. Thank you.